Hello, everybody, and this is Stacy from The Advisor, and today I'm very excited because we have a very special guest today. Well, I should say guests because we have two people here today from BioOx, and they are amazing. They had just joined our podcast community, and they have their own podcast on our show. So if you look at our page, you'll see their podcast, and they have some great information to share today about how to improve your overall health. And we have Lisa Ratul, and we have Sam here today. And they're going to share a little about BioOx and what it does and all the great things that it could do to help enhance your overall health. So Lisa, Sam, tell us a little about yourself, what you do, and a little about your company and how you got started. All right, I'll start. So my name is Lisa, and my background is fairly diverse. So I started my career as a research scientist in the pharmaceutical industry, so I worked creating pharmaceutical product that would be used in clinical trials. And I was a research scientist for several years, and then I decided to make a career transition. So I changed both industry and function following business school. And I worked in strategy roles, marketing roles in various industries. I worked in automotive at Jaguar Land Rover. I've worked in telecom at Verizon, and I'm here now, and I feel like I've really come full circle. Mm -hmm. And I'm so glad that I met Sam because I was looking for really meaningful work. Um, a, a lot of changes happened during the pandemic. I lost an uncle to cancer, That's my beloved pet to cancer, and really learning about biowox and biooxygen and a lot of their different studies and trials and how they're really trying to make a positive impact in people's lives as well as animals. It really resonated with me. So I'm I'm very happy here at my role at BioOx. So tell me a little about BioOx and what it does. Sure. So we have a whole family of products and it's based on the science of rocks. So rocks stands for reservoir of oxygen. And it's highly concentrated bullets of oxygen and nitric oxide. And that technology, that biotechnology is patented, is used in a whole family of products. We have our bio-oxygen water supplement. So that's water that's infused with rock. So those highly concentrated bullets of oxygen, nitric oxide, biomicroorganisms, enzymes. So that's a, a wonderful water supplement that really everyone could use in various, and we'll go into that, all the various um, illnesses or even just maintenance of well-being. And then we also have an air scrubber that's used by many major universities and medical schools, and that really cleans, um, destroys contaminants in the air. It's stronger than HEPA. It's stronger than UV, all those standard filters. It's not just an air purifier that essentially moves around dirty air yeah. through the um, recirculates dirty air. It truly captures and destroys air contaminants. Wow. And then we have a whole grow product, which could be used for agriculture and even um, everyday people growing plants. So we do have a whole family of products using this rocks technology, which was discovered by Sam. Wow. Now tell people a little about the rocks because people are going to say, well, you know, how do these rocks really make your health better? How does it enhance your health? Can you explain the uh, potency of it and, and why it has such a traumatic improvement? It can have a traumatic improvement in your health. Well, it really is using the power of nature and it has much more highly concentrated oxygen even compared to red blood cells. Like wow. even someone was notifying me that um, com rocks compared to red blood cells, it has two and a half times the amount of oxygen. So it's very highly concentrated and it does give you that energetic boost, but it's not like a caffeine or an energy drink that eventually depletes you or a vitamin drink that eventually you metabolize very quickly. It builds in your system slowly over time and you start seeing those effects over time and it, and it stays with you. I know Sam has a lot of personal experience with existing customers, long-term customers where they've seen it for themselves, really that impact that Rox has made in their lives. 
So as it goes into your body and it, and it starts to build up, what parts of the body is it, is it improving? Because, you know, oxygen, you know, really affects the entire body. So is it going through the entire body and helping the body, you know, um, circulate and, and, and work better? Um, is it, you know, what are some of the benefits when you start to use BioOx and it starts to, you know, after a, cer a certain period of time, as it builds up into your system, what's going to start happening? Like, what have you noticed, you know, between clients and between research, you know, what do you see the, the changes going on in people's bodies once they start to use it? I'll, I'll refer to Sam for a lot of those aspects and really going to the deep science, but ultimately our bodies are an energy management system. Right. It's all about reverting back to energy. That mm -hmm. relates to your immune system. That yeah. relates to your cardiovascular system and your nervous system. All your different systems are intertwined and it really reverts back to that energy response. So I'll let Sam go into more of the detail about how mm -hmm. rocks and oxygen, nitric oxide can really impact someone's health. Okay. So you want me to start there? Well, uh, the basic point is that uh, uh, our immune system has intelligence. Our body has intelligence. And so, for example, um, if, if some dog, some pet, or some person has cancer, uh, if this supply of oxygen goes in the mouth, under the tongue, the body will take it to where it's needed most. So it may be attacking a tumor, or it may be attacking a virus, or it may be just calming down your nerves by giving your nerves enough oxygen. Right. So um, um, the way it happens is that your body makes its own reserve of oxygen. It's not like we invented it. Right. The body already does that. And um, But in these days, we have a lot of contamination around us. Believe me, all of us are breathing gasoline vapors, even though yes. we don't smell them. Mm -hmm. And our lungs have to process it. Our livers have to use up the oxygen to get rid of it and some pesticides and plastics. So what happens is our reserves of oxygen go down mm -hmm. and then we can catch all kinds of diseases. We can even yes. catch cancer. Right. Uh, so uh, that's the modern modern life. So it, 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 we need su some supplement and we can get that supplement from actually what nature already provides, like uh, soil, healthy soil actually makes rocks for the plants and uh, like plants have immune systems too. So the bottom line is uh, our bodies are basically made of water and uh, oxygen does not go into water. Right. So uh, the body does that by taking the oxygen from the red blood cells, the white blood cells do that and packing it into bullets. We're calling them bullets, very highly concentrated, very small uh, particles of oxygen. So they can get to where they need to go without having to go through the circulation system. Right. So, uh, uh, and we just discovered that. Uh, uh, it started, there's a long story behind that, but we just discovered that, uh, how it's done. So what really enhanced you to to look into this further? So you said there's a long story behind it. You don't have to tell us the whole long story, but you know, what made you really go into this direction where you acknowledge, you know, the benefits of BioOx and how you pursued it? Like what, you know, what really, you know, really stirred you to- Well, really when, I, when I started working as a professor in the university, um, I had an engineering background too. Uh, and uh, this uh, researcher invited me because he was having a question. He was studying shock on dogs and, um, it turned out that he has extracorporeal circulation. What they mean is, is they take the blood out of the body, they process it and put it back in the body. Right. So when you do that, when you're taking blood out, you have to add heparin to prevent the blood from clotting. Right. So I guess for controls or something, he did not add heparin. And then, and then what they do is expose the dog to shock. And when exposing the dog to shock, the shocks were not only did their, did their, body, their blood not clot, so their blood was not clotting, even though they had that pump. And the dogs were resistant to shock. They were not getting shock. They were not dying of this, uh, what they call DIC, where everything in your body clots. Right. So that was a mystery. Why is that? And to try to use regular science, it was very, very difficult. They, they have all these boxes. There's all these clotting factors and everything. So it had to be something else. So I've been working on that for decades, actually. And uh, I got the 
uh, research professorship, um, uh, five-year uh, unrestricted research grant uh, at New Jersey Institute of Technology. And so then I, I did not have peer review, so I could do whatever I wanted. And we, we then began to discover that, that there's a source of oxygen in there that's coming out, not when we want it to come out, but when the white blood cells want it to come out. It's like uh -huh. watching TV. So you're stressing these white blood cells in a little bioreactor, and then all of a sudden you see these beautiful peaks coming out. And so you have to try to figure out what's going on. So that's what started it. And uh, uh, so that's how we discovered how to make it, was how the body makes it. Wow. And as a result, going back to dogs, because we don't like to experiment on dogs except to try to save their lives. Yes. So we made the special BioOxygen Plus that we call, and it had an immediate effect, immediate effect on sick dogs. Like they'd perk up. Mm. The first thing that would happen to them is their, their mind would work better. They would signal to, for instance, uh, this person came from New York and was very interested in our product and brought Lexi, his sick dog with him. Lexi had tumors all over the place. Oh, wow. And uh, <clears throat> she was very, she was very weak, but when the, her, when her owner went into the bathroom, she sort of like went toward the bathroom and I said, don't worry, Lexi, he's going to come right back out. Mm -hmm. So this was before she took her first serving of BioOxygen Plus. So, so then we gave her a serving of BioOxygen Plus under the tongue. Yes. Her body knew what to do with it. So her body, the first thing it did, it, it made her more alert, less brain fog. What happened is, so before he went back to New York City, he was going to use the bathroom again. This time, before she went into the plant where she's not supposed to go, you know, where everybody's working, mm -hmm. she looked at me and nodded. She looked at me and nodded. So I knew, wow, she's thinking. And she's telling me she wants to go in there. So there was a huge change for her right away. And over the months, her some of her uh, tumors started going away. Her color of her fur started coming back. Wow. And uh, even her vet said her vet said her uh, uh, her uh, complexion has improved. I didn't know dogs had complexions, but I knew what, after he said that, I knew what he meant. So um, the bottom line is that the body recognizes it. The body knows what to do with it. And rocks exists in healthy plants, in healthy soil, in healthy water, uh, and uh, in healthy humans. Wow, that's amazing. Oh my goodness. You know, what are some of the conditions that, you know, you've seen um, BioOx help over the course of the years as you've been working with this product? Well, um, uh, I, we, have a, we have a school of thought. We have uh, many doctors and stuff. For six years, we had these lunch and learns to try to develop this theory, what's going on, because uh, now that we had a precision scientific instrument, we had to devise a, a very well thought out uh, um, clinical study. Yeah. So we did our clinical studies in the, with this school of thought. But so some of them are medical doctors. And for instance, uh, Dr. Brelvi, uh, who's definitely preaching about rocks to his patients, gave one of his patients a taste of bio-oxygen beverage. This patient had um, a chronic fatigue syndrome and unfortunately had a lab job, which requires for him to stand up. Yeah. Standing up for 15 minutes would get him exhausted. Right. So with just a cap full of the bio-oxygen, he saw an improvement. So he came to me and he ordered a case, which is like four gallons of bio-ox, bio-oxygen beverage. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, it turns out he was using two gallons a week, which is really a huge amount, you know? And I was telling him, listen, you know, you don't really need to use that much. He said, I know what I need to use. <laughs> so, um, he had two gallons a week for like maybe 15, uh, maybe 20 gallons, something like that. And he started walking five miles a day, not just working. He, wow. So now he's like a regular user. He knows when he needs it. And he comes by and he picks up the, the gallons he needs. And he only buys them by the four gallon case because that's he knows he's going to use it all the time. And don't you yeah. feel like also, Sam, with with bio, our bio-oxygen customers, sometimes we see that where they need to really front load things where they say they're suffering from an ailment and they, they make sure that they drink a large quantity, a concentrated version, and they really get ahead of it. And then after they start really feeling better and that, again, that bio oxygen, that rocks builds in your system over time, once you yeah. have that reserve, then over time you, 
essentially just need that maintenance. Mm -hmm. So um, our our customers, they really personalize it. How yeah. he said, no, I know what I need and what I want. Yeah. So exactly what Sam was saying earlier, your body tells you how much you need and your body also takes that rocks and puts it exactly where it's needed. So we receive that feedback a lot from certain customers that they really need to um, front load it where they drink a high concentration a lot. And then once they get their systems regulated, then it's even a maintenance. And that's how I am. I, I personally don't suffer from major ailments or a major illness, but I, how I start my morning is with the maintenance of, instead of drinking my tea, I'll, I'll start off with a glass of bio oxygen. So it's, mm -hmm. it's been a part of my whole lifestyle now. Yeah, I do that too, actually. And my wife does it too. It helps her arthritis. But I think the first thing most people notice is it takes away brain fog. Mm -hmm. uh, and I think that the, well, the, the central nervous system, the brain and the spinal column, Mm -hmm. They use twenty percent of your oxygen, but they only weigh two percent of your body. So they are major, major users of oxygen. So uh, uh, that's why it helps brain fog. The body decides the first thing it wants to do to make you think better. Right. And uh, so um, uh, I take it to I take it all the time. Uh, I, I try to take at least eight ounces a day. Mm -hmm. But in the morning, uh, when I'm in a big crowd with a big crowd, sometimes I'm in a packed room. Like we went to the Metropolitan Museum of Art. And yes. they had this thing about the uh, dress, old ancient dresses and all that. And they made you walk through. And there were so many people walking through. You could feel there wasn't enough air to breathe, you know. Yeah. You could feel all the fibers. But uh, uh, so after that, you, you don't want to get exposed to, to disease too. So mm -hmm. I actually gargle it. I actually gargle it really deep and then swallow it. Because uh, we know it does things like it does kill pathogens. Really? There's intelligence. There's intelligence involved. And uh, it has, it's long lasting. In other words, when you drink the bio oxygen, there's one enzyme called catalase. Catalase enzyme in mice, it's known to prevent the onset of diabetes mm -hmm. and it's known to extend their age. I don't believe in the mouse model myself. I, 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 you know, I, I think that if you've got something for humans and dogs, give it to them, you know? Right. right. <clears throat> but in any case, that's what catalase does. And catalase stays with you. So like when you take vitamin C, very important, antioxidant, you know, you take it and then you pee the rest of it out, you know, right. and it's done. So you have to take it again. But when you, catalase goes in, your catalase stays mm -hmm. and it keeps making antioxidants for you. It helps. It. So it's, it's a different thing. It's a live thing. It's a continuous thing. And the, the biomass in there actually stays and works with your gut uh, right. uh, and with your body. So uh, it also works with the gut bacteria is what I'm saying, basically. But I use it too. I, I drink some before tennis, mm -hmm. you know, and um, just try to get some extra exercise because we don't have that much time to play. Yeah. So then for practice, I'd like chase, try to chase balls down, you know, just mm -hmm. to get the, the exercise in. But I think it helps that way. So that's, it's, that's it's amazing. Natural. You know, <clears throat> when they say, for instance, if you're sick, go to the mountains and everything. Mm -hmm. Well, that's true go to the forest. That's true too. When you go to a forest, the, the trees actually make rocks because they, they send that oxygen down to the roots. Oh, the roots I see. Grow. Yes. The trees sense. have to use oxygen too, you know? Mm -hmm. So um, uh, that's healthy and that's all about rocks. And the seaside, sometimes when you listen to the bubbles as a wave settles down, you can smell it. Or in a waterfall, you can actually smell the rocks, you know? So, uh, and also people who are healthy, have an aura of rocks about them. They have an aura of this oxygen about them. So when healthy people are near sick people, they actually help the sick people. And these are kind of like known things, you know, uh, from, from the ancient past. And I also view it almost as a shield, like you're saying aura helps uh, when you have a healthy person next to a sick person, but also helps keep the healthy person healthy. So yes. it's not as impacted, like the example you gave with the crowded museum, I, I find that I'm less susceptible to disease or viruses. And then even when I do get sick, it's at a lesser magnitude than say yes. others or, or what I've experienced previously. It really does build that immune system using that so, rocks energy. Yeah, along those lines, if I may, um, uh, we have a unit at the dental surgery 
uh, lab at the uh, University Hospital this here. This is in, our air scrubber. Our air scrubber. Air scrubber. <clears throat> but as Lisa said, it's all about oxygen and it's all about energy. So these air scrubbers, what they do is when they absorb a germ like COVID, mm -hmm. they destroy it. So <clears throat> to do that, they they need to make rocks. So they do make rocks and they emanate some rocks. So during the COVID epidemic, this was an emergency surgery place. So it had to be open and none of the people got sick. Mm -hmm. That's the input they gave me. So this machine was not only getting the COVID out of the air and destroying it there, but it was spreading the rocks around to the people. And that's why oh, wow. they, they didn't get sick. So um, again, it's the, the air scrubbers have um, biomass from healthy soil, healthy nature in yes. them already. It's like having a healthy little lake uh, in your surgery room. Yeah. Using the science <clears throat> of nature to purify the air, to purify, I should say, scrub the air. Yeah. To, and then to improve our health and immune systems. And again, like the cardiovascular system, nervous system, the, the soil with our grow product, using the existing technology that nature has already provided to us. So it's natural, but also very strong and effective. It doesn't impact the effectiveness in any way. The, the microorganisms we use, we also use activated white blood cells when it's really serious, but the microorganisms we use come from the earth. Right. And they came before humans came because they had to clean the air. The air was really dirty and they had to clean the water. The water was full of heavy metals and stuff. Yes. So that life would begin. Yeah. So we're just using that system, you know, to mm -hmm. help restore the environment, whether it's indoors or outdoors. So it, it kind of feels good doing that. Yeah. So strategy right now, everybody's strategy is if somebody has cancer. Oh, let's po poison them. Let's give them radioactive stuff. Let's, yeah. let's give them x-rays, you know, strong x-rays. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, we think that the real problem is the body is weak. That's why it got the cancer. Yes. And it needs the boost. And if it has the boost, their own immune system will do the work. We're right. just the, the water boys in a, in a football team or something like that. We're just supplying them with something they need. Because the tumor, say what cancer, like even previously Sam was referring to the dog cancer study, those tumors need oxygen. So when, when someone drinks our bio-oxygen water supplement, then that rocks is is directed to those spaces. So it would be the tumor that needs that oxygen. Yeah. Then the oxygen bullets within the rocks will then oxygenate that tumor. And then as Sam was mentioning within the dog study, those tumors were shrinking, the quality of life was improving and the lifespan was also extended. So we started to see with multiple studies that there is a positive effect. The key to remember, the key thing is to remember that uh, your body, my body, our body is intelligent. Yes. It's not a stupid thing. Oh, no. And and so uh, that's the key. And yeah. then you have to see, well, what's wrong? If the body is intelligent, what's wrong? What's missing? And right. then you realize with all this pollution, all this nervous stress, I mean, you can get nervous stress to give you cancer. Oh, 100%. You know? mm -hmm. So, so uh, the body is being stressed and you have to cause it, you, you have to help it where it needs it. We breathe 20,000 times a day. Yes. And our our body, our the amount of oxygen in our body only la in our red blood cells, the amount of oxygen in our red blood cells only lasts four minutes. Wow. And, you know, and so the question is, why? And so that's why we have to breathe all the time. Yes. And uh, the body then takes it and packs it. And actually, the amount of uh, rocks that everybody has in their bodies, you have in your body, I have in my body, is much more than the amount of oxygen that's in the red blood cells. Yeah. So that means when they're measuring your pulse ox, pulse ox is when they put that thing on your finger, mm -hmm. and they say if it's 95 to 100%, you're yes. good to go. Yeah. We're saying it's very important. It's very important that you're 95 to 100, that your red blood cells are saturated, but it's not enough. Right. Not enough. After the oxygen goes into your red blood cells, it has to be packed into these bullets. If it's not, then you're very, very sick. And this really, really happens because some people during COVID would go to the hospital, they check their pulse ox and say, you're good to go. Right. They'd go home, they'd get so sick when they'd come back, they'd almost be dead. And that's bad for the hospital, actually. Yeah. Now they've got two visits instead of one and they got a sicker person. And also, you know, uh, for insurance purposes, 
the hospitals can't send people back and have them the come key, back. The key reading, though, what you're saying is that the pulse ox was normal, but the rocks was low. So you need that rocks measurement to really have that 360 holistic view of your health because, yeah. you know, it makes an impact. And you couldn't, you can't blame the doctors. It's not their fault because if your oxygen is low to your red blood cells, uh, they have to put you on some kind of a respirator. Yes. Because they're thinking, they're thinking that your lungs are not working properly. But we're thinking that, no, your lungs are working really properly, thank you. It's just that that you're so diseased that your white blood cells are taking the oxygen out of the red blood cells and using them right away. It's not that your lungs need boosting. Yes. Uh, it's the, uh, So, so uh, in other words, you could have a lower pulse ox and still be very healthy. Yes. You know, so, uh, again, the medical, and again, you can't be blaming the medical system. It's not their fault because they don't know. If you're going to blame anybody, you should blame us because we, we haven't been able to reach the people yet. Yes. You know, it, it's amazing because, you know, they talk about, you know, the contamination, you know, you, see, you know, there's more contamination when you walk out the door than there is in your house. And there's a lot of contamination with dust particles and all different things that we use, chemicals that we use to clean the house, the detergents we use, you know, the soaps we use, you can go on and on and on. But when you walk out of the house, it's just the air we breathe outside the house. And just like you had mentioned before, you know, there's so much contamination people don't know because they can't see it. You know, and it's it's you know we're in a society where we're not really taking care of the environment, you know, uh, the way we should, and so we are actually harming ourselves in a sense, you know, and we're harming our bodies. And if you look at if, if you look at the statistics of all these different conditions that are out there, we're increasing very rapidly. All conditions that we didn't have and allergies we didn't have when we were younger, you see people having them now. And the question is why you know, and I think a lot has to do with the way we, we take care of this planet, the way we, you know, take care of ourselves, you know, how, what we put in our bodies, you know, they, we can go on and on and on and on, but I feel that, you know, a product like BioOff could do a really great service because if you take BioOx and, and you're, you're putting, you're, you're, you're drinking BioOx and you're putting it in your body and it's helping your body facilitate uh, the, the ingredients, the, the things that it needs in order for it to work properly build that immune system and 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 help you you know heal in certain ways you know it could really you know help maybe with your longevity help with the current status that you're in you know from you know help help you you know heal in in ways you know because a lot of people go to the doctor because you know it's it's they say it's it's cheaper i know people that will go and they'll have surgery before they try something holistically only because their insurance will cover it you know and the and then they'll be back 2 3 years later with the same problem and it'll be even worse so, you know, to invest in yourself, to invest a small amount of money in something that is natural that you can put into your body and then have complete and it can heal your body or it can enhance your overall health. It, it's just, you know, it, it, it makes sense and it blows my mind, you know, how people need, really need to open up and, and really think about the alternative. You know, if we're going to live in a planet that has so many toxins, you know, I, you know, the air we breathe, you know, the, the ground we walk on, a lot of soils are contaminated because of the way we took care of them, you know, we really have to consider, you know, um, you know, trying to take care of ourselves and put things in our body that are going to help heal our, our body and help our body and, and help with the longevity of our body, because, you know, nobody wants to suffer. And, and, you know, there are so many different conditions out there and people are, you know, if the health is declining in, in our society, you could just look at statistically and you can see the statistics everything has gone up you know instead of going down so you know then we have to stop and think what can we do to help our bodies and to help you know the people around us like our families so we can actually live the quality of life that we deserve you know and, and I was thinking when you were talking you know when you talked about being foggy, I had known so many people that had gotten COVID. And one of the main components that they talked about is that after COVID, they their brain, they felt a, 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 tra a traumatic um, degree of brain fog, and they never had that before. And some people talked about being off balance. And even my husband, he got the first strand of COVID that was several years back, and he lost his smell and taste, and he never got it back. You know, so, you know, these are things that you you don't you know 
if there, you know, if you put the right components in your body, I'm not saying it's going to completely heal it, but it might help to actually, you know, help you heal naturally and make your, yourself better than what you currently are at the status you're at, you know, and, and I've, I've done in many different natural treatments and it has helped me tremendously. And it does take some time, you know, and that's what people have to realize too, that you can't go in and take a product and think, okay, in, in a week I should feel better or a couple of days I feel better. And I can't tell you how much mentality, you know, people want to feel better in a couple of days. They want to see quick results, but you know, I, I think, you know, in order to see just a small result, you have to, to, I've noticed in my, in my own, my own studies, at least three months just to see a small resort, you know, a result. And then you start seeing as it enhances. And I'm not saying that with biox. I'm just saying in general, with the things that I've tried that are natural and effective, it, it took a little time because it had to build up in your system. And then as it built up in your system, you started to notice changes. Like you, I noticed little changes. And then I noticed, because I'm very aware of my body. And, and then I noticed as, as time went on, I got better and better and better and better. And, you know, when you take BioOx, is there a certain amount of time, a time, everybody's body is different. So everybody is different. But is there, you know, do you start noticing you have, from previous clients that you've had, did they say they started noticing an improvement right away or that it took them a couple you know, of weeks or a couple what? months? You start receiving, I mean, everyone's different, mm -hmm. but say we were even um, targeting the fitness segment, say we're at Mr. America, a whole fitness competition with power lifting, those type of things. Yeah. And so some of those power lifters were taking a shot of bio-oxygen, then going up there and someone gave us feedback that he felt a boost of energy and right away he could power lift and he was successful. Someone else that we met at a show, she's in her 60s, she's a marathon runner and she, you know, she goes to the gym every day and yeah. she took a shot of our bio-oxygen for the first time. She was shocked that she could see a dramatic increase in her ability just that right. day she felt more energetic. So you do feel sometimes a shot of yeah. energy, but I, I would say it, to have that long-term effect, like even when we were mentioning earlier, to have that build in your system that could take time, like even right. within the dog study, it took yeah. time for the of dogs course. to yeah. have the... Um, the tumors shrink. I mean, some of those just take time, but we do see that, especially within the fitness segment where those, those type of customers are already healthy. They yeah. start seeing right away um, a dramatic impact. Sometimes like uh, when I feel an allergy coming up, um, I definitely chug some. Uh, and as I mentioned before, when I'm in a big crowd, I want to just uh, use it for that reason. Yeah. Uh, there was a kid at this Mr. America show whose mom and dad were weightlifters. He was like uh, maybe four feet high. You know, he was a little bit chubby. Mm -hmm. and he, he was uh, he was cute. He was just walking around. He was killing time. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> he wanted to try some. I said, you have to ask your mom. Right. I don't know why I said that because, you know. Yeah. Some, uh, but anyway, he comes back and he says, she said, yes. So I let him have some. I said, now that you're doing these laps around these boots, come back around and tell me how it felt. So apparently he came back three or four times wanting more and more and more. So this was his kid. So I think the more you need it, the more you notice it. Like uh, sometimes when I come home from work, uh, there's a Route 46, famous Route 46, that's uh, full of cars and mm -hmm. just all sorts of exhaust smoke coming back, you know, and that gives me a headache. Right. And I, I drink, make sure I, I forget, you know, but I, 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 we keep our gallon jug on the counter. Yes. I the gallon jug and I have a big sip and it makes the, that headache go away. Wow. Like essentially yeah. instantly. Right. Because also I, I have <clears throat> suffered from migraines. Yeah. And since drinking bio oxygen, I've seen a decrease in the occurrence of migraines. That's, I can just speak to myself personally, but right. I think it deals with both hydration and then again, the rocks biotechnology. So both of those things for me personally, I could speak to that my migraines have decreased considerably. Wow. That's so amazing. we have a guest coming and she's had to our house, a house guest, you know, a relative, and she's had uh, lichens in her mouth forever mm -hmm. and they, they can't get rid of it. So I'm going to have her uh, rinse and have bio oxygen uh, during the two weeks she's here. And I'll let you know what she thinks. I'd love to know. Yeah. You know, you were mentioning about the planet. Mm -hmm. uh, 
for a long time, we were burning lead in gasoline. Yes. And, you know, now that we're not, we're thinking it disappeared. It did not disappear. Right. It came back with the rainwater into our soil and into our water. It didn't go away. Right. So everything we've done, all the sins of the past are still there. Like we used to practice atomic bombs in the air and mm -hmm. we still have plutonium around, which is a real poison. So the, the, lo the longer we wait, the dirtier our air and water get. Yes. But our style for farming has been like put straight ammonia into the soil and kill everything because that way you don't have to come back and kill weeds <laughs> and then put a genetically engineered plant in there or yeah. not. But, but, uh, that should be, it's just like what we do with, with cancer, you know, yeah. kill everything. Oh yeah. The patient will die less than the cancer will die. We're doing the same thing with the soil. So it's like, we have the same strategy to attack everything, you know? Yeah. And we have to change that. We have to think more naturally. Yes. Because nature is much more powerful than the real, than, than all these drugs. Right. And also yeah. going back to Stacy, what you were saying about contaminants in the air, because now oxygen comprises about 20% of the air, but mm -hmm. before it was even a higher percentage, right, yeah. you start seeing it decreasing over time. So we're literally, even if we remove all contaminants from the air, we're still actually breathing in less oxygen. So yeah. the rocks in, in that bio-oxygen water supplement helps that way to replenish those rocks. Um, supplement and then also what i use not only the water supplement i do have the air scrubber in my house so that helps as well with contaminants at least in that controlled area yeah so you Your know that agrees with that my cat agrees so my cat uh is attracted to the biowax bioreactor because you have it's a, a water circulation and she's attracted to that water and sam and i were talking about how animals naturally are attracted to things that are pure and natural. And I yes. even give, give her a little bit of my bio oxygen. She drinks it right away. And I, I think of that as a preventative measure as well, because cancer rates, I, I just see it with, with my pets. I, I treat them phenomenally, perfect care. And frequently I've, I've experienced cancer with my pets as well. So, you know, you do all you can and in, in what you can control within an environment. Right. I agree. Well, you see how how the how the planet is changing. You see global warming. We just had a a, a news flash in New Jersey that we had an uh, earthquake at at uh, three a.m. in the morning, and you know we've had about four in the past month and a half. And so, you know, when have you ever heard of the East Coast getting earthquakes? You know, my, my hometown was the epicenter of the earthquake. Oh, really? <laughs> Running to New Jersey. <laughs> yeah. And, you know, it's like, you know, you think about why these things are happening. You know, it's because of the environment, how we're caring for the environment, how things over time, it's wearing down the environment. So if it's wearing down the environment, imagine what it's doing to us because we are a part of that environment. We use this environment in order to stay alive. You know, we need in order, you know, the trees create oxygen. We breathe oxygen to stay alive. You know, everything we do, you know, everything, there's a reason and purpose for everything natural on this planet to keep us alive and to keep us growing and to keep us, you know, here. And so what, if we keep, if we, you know, like you said, it's you know, things that we did, you know, decades ago are still affecting us. So can you imagine, this is probably one of the main factors why we are, our healths are declining and you see more conditions occurring than ever before. And, you know, it's, it's, you know, if we can do things to help us, like, you know, put, you know, better oxygen into our system to use the rocks to, to, you know, to go into our system, to stay, go into our cells, to go into our body and, and go into areas where we need help, where our body needs healing, you know, that's a huge factor because, you know, I, I, you know, it's, it's so important because there are things out there that can help heal the body naturally. And biox is one of them. And you, you want something natural that's going to go into your body and help with the healing process, you know, because everybody, I guarantee you has something because you, on this planet, you know, you talk to everybody, they, they complain about something, whether it's pain, whether it's fatigue, you know, whether it's a, you know, a, a nervous condition caused by maybe, you know, something not going right, you know, you know, it, you know, with their mental health, you know, you never know, you know, with the proper care and the proper elements in your body, how your body can improve over time. I would say bio oxygen and rocks are water supplement. 
The best way to describe it from my own personal perspective is that mm -hmm. it really helps with your overall vitality and well-being. And yes. Whatever it means to you and whatever you need, you can personalize it. We have, say, different concentrations. You can drink varying amounts, but really personalize it for your own vitality and well-being. And I think another thing, too, is when, when you were discussing this with me, I think about as we get older, our energy levels decline because we become deficient in so many different vitamins and sources in our body. And, you know, uh, fatigue is one of them. You know, you talk, you know, people talk about fatigue all the time. You know, as they get older, they don't have the energy to, to do many of the things that they did before. But if you could have something that can give you a boost, a natural boost, you know, and it's not going to come into your body like coffee or some, one of those over the counter, you know, drinks that claim to give you all this energy, but at the same time, it can give you a heart attack. At you know, so, you know, you could have something natural, you know, and you can get that energy boost and you could actually, you know, accomplish the things you want to accomplish because as you get older and, or if you have a condition, you know, fatigue is, is something that could be, it, it's, it could be, it could, it could even cause depression because when you are like, if you're so tired that you're constantly sleeping or you can't get off the couch, you know, and you can't do the things that you once did, you know, when you were younger, that, that that's a, a huge impact on someone's mental well-being and physical well-being. Absolutely. It's a conundrum. Exactly yes. what you need to do, you can't do. You need to be active. But if you don't have the energy, then you start falling into that cycle of depression and then it becomes that endless cycle. So exactly that, you know, we really view our bio-oxygen water supplement as that tool that someone can use and use as a lever to improve their vitality and, and minimize fatigue. Now, if you had to, you know, look at everything we discussed today, what are three important things, or, you know, you can even say more than three if you like, but what are some things that you'd want, like to emphasize to make the, the listeners understand about our discussion today? Well, I think, again, bio-oxygen is a tool that you can use, and it's personalized for you, and every person is different, every person's needs are different, and please explore our website. We have various research studies that we run with medical schools with hepatitis C, pain management, and we're continuing to explore different case studies. So please continue to learn about our product and service and learn about rocks. And hopefully we're educating people as well as the science and behind rocks in our products. So we're really excited to bring awareness to our whole family of products and specifically bio-oxygen because I think that's something that everyone can really use in their daily lives. And it, it truly makes an impact, whether it's maintenance of your health, preventative measures, or actively trying to improve your health when you have a health ailment such as pain management. So it really is personalized for the person. And we really look forward to more people learning about our product and service and learning about rocks. So we, you know, we really appreciate the opportunity today. Oh, you're very welcome. Well, yeah. Anybody has more questions they could ask us on the website. Uh, and where, can you tell me your website again, your website address where they can find you? www.biowalks.us. Yeah, biox. <laughs> Biox.us. And is, if um, if people want to purchase your product, where can they find your product right now? Online, directly oh. online. Um, it, we're direct to consumer. So please find us online. And we look forward to getting to know you and building a relationship because we truly do build relationships with our customers. We're, we're very curious to see where you are, um, where you are with your health right now what needs to be improved and how bio-oxygen can help you get there. So please stay in contact with us. We really truly appreciate our loyal customers and, and our new customers that just learn about us as well. Well, this has been amazing. I thank you so much for coming on the show. I can't wait till you guys come back again. I think it's so important because, you know, I, I think that if someone could have a, a drink like BioOx and they can actually, it can help 
heal the body and it can help, you know, enhance your energy. It could help you with so many different things like brain, brain fog. And, you know, and like I mentioned, I can't tell you how many people have said to me, I have brain fog ever since I got COVID. You know, these are, these are amazing things. And you, you know, you've talked about many other conditions in this conversation too. You know, why not give it a try? You know, if you haven't used it already, you know, you know, why not give it a try? You know, because, it, you know, I, I, I think the best thing is when we do things naturally, you know, because there are so many side effects and I've had many people, you know, have horror stories about med using medication that have an adverse side effects and never being the same again, you know, why not try something natural? You know, I'm a true believer in integrative medication, but you know, why don't we, you know, try na something natural first and let's see, you know, the results and then take it from there, you know, but I really admire your product. I love your product. And I, I thank you so much for taking the time to explain it. And I look forward to our next conversation because this is something we need. And like we said before, look at the environment. You know, it's, we've always had many contaminants in the air and in the, in the household. And, and, and we're taking all that in every single day. And just, you know, people have to stop and think, what is this doing to my body? And maybe the way I'm feeling is, is, a, is you know, a, one of the reasons why I feel is because of the contaminants, the things I use, the things I breathe in, you know, these are having an impact over the course of the years, you know, as we get older. So why not, you know, stop and think and, and try to do something about it, you know? So I thank you so much for doing the research, making the product and, and coming out with this amazing product that I, I'm going to be trying very soon because I'm very anxious to see, you know, how it could help me. Cause I definitely have a few things I'd like to improve in my own health. <laughs> as we all, but as thank, we all. You, thank you for your support thank you. and we appreciate that. We appreciate getting to know you and your audience. So thank you. Thank you. Oh, you're very welcome. Thank you. And I'll talk to you soon. Have a great day. You, you as well. Thanks. Bye. Bye-bye.